Yeah, that's right. Yeah, yeah. We've already been scanning. Yeah, we're all good. Yeah. We still have it. And you mean so it's gonna go down, go down some way. Yeah, it's yeah. flat. Yeah. Ukrainians' uh, Christmas season lasts for way longer. Like we don't end on the on the Christmas Eve or Christmas Day. It carries on for another like several weeks out. In fact, almost 40 days after that. And we have different kinds of winter carols. So some of them are the Christian kind of carols that talk about the story of what happened in Bethlehem. But lots of them are uh, left over from pre-Christian times. And the songs are kind of like special incantations. So you'll you probably recognize the most famous kind of Ukrainian winter carol. It's the one that sounds da 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 dum pa da da dum, known as Carol of the Bells in the in the West. But in Ukraine, it's got nothing to do with bells whatsoever. So it's it's saying. This uh, special bird is gonna come fly to your house and bring you good luck. And you'll have the most beautiful wife, the smartest kids, the best harvest, uh, all the best food on your table, everything like that, so. Щедрик, щедрик, щедрі вочка, прилетіла ласті вочка. Став собі щебітати, господаря викликати. Види, види, господарю, подивишся на кошарю. Щедрик, щедрі вочка, прилетіла ласті вочка. Щедрик, щедрик, щедрі вочка, прилетіла ласті вочка. Oh, we're rolling? Okay. <laughs>
present in the past I'm a silhouette, I don't know ya I'm walking over broken glass I'm crying over photographs Broken frames, broken dreams It's every day without you Is the longest night of my life Sorry that I hurt you Girl, I know that I shouldn't have lied And I know you tried Hi, Baraka. It's uh, great hearing your uh, original music. I was going to ask you uh, about uh, sort of holiday kind of traditions in Tanzania. Are there holiday kind of activities that go on there? Um, yes, I, I, it's a little bit different. Christmas is different in Tanzania. First of all, fun fact, I don't think I've ever had a Christmas tree in my house before. It's just never been a thing. Um, it's, it doesn't snow down there, so Christmas trees aren't really big. Yeah. But if you walk into a shop, they're going to have like Christmas decorations everywhere. And a big sort of tradition, I'd say, in many homes in Tanzania is share a meal with your family and friends. So typically, a staple in my home is we'd have like a barbecue goat every Christmas. We all get together, everybody's in, in there. And I remember when I was younger, uh, we used to watch The Sound of Music Where every is? single Christmas. So that's a, that's a little tradition for me. This 
from Satan's tyranny. From depths of hell, thy people will sing and give them. Spirit by thine advent here Disperse the dark and gloomy night And pierce the clouds and bring us light Rejoice, rejoice, Emmanuel shall come to thee Lovely ladies of Flower Hill, it's Andrea Monroe, Sherry Ryan, Maria Cherwick. Uh, I just want to ask you guys, was, was music a big part of the holiday season uh, for you guys when you're growing up? For me, definitely. Um, my dad was a classical pianist and my brother was and they kind of stuck to that. But at Christmas they'd break out the cheesiest, most fun Christmas songs <laughs> they could think of. and. Um, there was always music on the go and singing was a big yeah. part of it. Yeah. And Sherry, I know your family, they all like to sing. Don't yeah, I think when I was around teenage years, we started to have a Christmas night party at our house and it would always be a lot of singing, all ages, that kind of thing. Yeah. We don't need to ask you because we know what you do for Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> so. have gently fallen and the nights are closing in and the autumn winds are all but gone another year is nearly over and I'm older though it seems this Christmas I'll be coming home but this time here it brings me back to when I was a child all the memories of trimming trees and dinner on the boil all that little town joy from ear to ear where the waters gleam with Christmas cheer so let's get the kids a light and leave our worries behind for tomorrow will be Christmas day let's take your right by peace of mind with a boat shine bright with the lights in Boats all laced in green and red For me it's been a while Can't help but smile The family's hand in hand For a picture on this night We won't forget So let's get the kids in line And leave our worries behind For tomorrow will be Christmas Day Let's take a ride by peace of mind With a boat shine bright With the lights in pole With care and pride The harbor's alive As they roll with the tides The lights may 
fade, but the memories remain. For the more things change, the more they stay the same. Music like a big uh, part, or Christmas music a big part of your uh, growing up yeah. experience? Yeah, Christmas in general was big in my house and still is for that matter. But uh, one of my earliest memories is kind of my dad would make Christmas ornaments in the shed out of plywood, oh, yes. cut them out, paint them, put lights in them and stuff. And, and I was there maybe at three, four years old, you know, pretending to do something. But <laughs> it's one of my earliest memories. So yeah, Christmas is always a big time of year in our house. And was music a big part of that too? Oh, for sure. Yeah, like back in, there's videos of me with a little pretend guitar, you know, mm -hmm. pretending to sing and play. And I did, once again, I didn't know what I was doing, but I, I, I knew that there was something about Christmas music that really attracted, it really attracted me to it and to the season, you know, just in general, so. Patrick, was there any big Christmas traditions in your family? Yeah, or? a lot of music. Yeah. Uh, going to, uh, like, of course, being in elementary school or whatever, we always had the Christmas concert was always a big deal. So you sure. rehearsed, you started rehearsing for that in October yeah. or something like that. <laughs> and yeah. that was always kind of a big deal. And of course, you know, uh, Blue Christmas. And, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, and my sister played piano and I played fiddle and stuff along with her. Yeah. And my mom used to sing. And There's one song I remember I did at the one Christmas concert, Winter Wonderland. I oh, think yeah. So. yeah. And there's a big key change in it, right? And Ooh. I was like 10 or 12 and it took me forever to try to figure it out. But uh, <laughs> Not much has changed, Brad. <laughs> no. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> exactly. Still yeah. gets tangly from time to time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. My sister one year gave me a, a cassette tape of the Beatles Revolver, uh, but she put it in a big box that would have fit a furniture model TV, you know. So all, this is sitting by the mantle all Christmas. I'm going, what's in the big box? Oh my God, you know. And. Um, and then I, there was a rubber boot in there, and uh, just all this junk, you know, that I had to go through until I got to the the Beatles tape, you know. So I remember that one, yeah. <laughs>
Twas the night before Christmas, seven o'clock. A rusty old dragger ties up at the dock. She's rigged out in lights from her stem to her stern to spend Christmas Eve in St. John. All the sailors are tired, lonely and bored. A piece of dry land is all they're longing for. But their hearts are away on some foreign shore this Christmas Eve in St. John's. Oh, is Festus, Feliz Navidad. In a faraway country, a young girl is sad. Oh, it's the night before Christmas, and she misses her dad, spending Christmas Eve in St. John. Like the Magi, they travel from the east long ago, up to the hilltop, to Mass they'd all go. Their lady of Fatima, she waits for them there This Christmas Eve in St. John. They hear the old carols sung when they were young But they don't sound the same, sung in this foreign tongue Their hearts are warm, but their eyes tell the tale this Christmas Eve in St. John's Oh, was Festus Feliz Navidad In a faraway country A young girl is sad It's the night before Christmas And she misses her dad Spending Christmas Eve in St. John's It's back to the ships The sailors all go To the by a portal In new fallen snow And soon it's back To the fish they must go This Christmas Eve in St. John Oh, is Festus Feliz Navidad in a faraway country, a young girl is sad. Oh, it's the night before Christmas, and she misses her dad, spending Christmas Eve in St. John's. Spending Christmas Eve in St. John's. Safely, don't know what I'm thinking lately. Thoughts get tucked away in the busy day to day. Wrap the presents, hang the stockings, light the fire, done with talking. Feelings coming through, thinking gentle thoughts of you. The tides of time move out and in, it's just the sea we're swimming in. I see you in every season. On the days I find it hard to find my way Thinking of your love gives me reason the Spring comes round again With promises of new beginnings the Summer days flow Running home under street light glow all brings quiet contemplation I 
guess there's nothing new The kids are fine and I am too But I miss you most of all At Christmas time Thoughts of you sometimes seem so far Christmas time Nine whole years since you've been gone And Christmases they carry on Mom, she sold the house She lives in a condo now Your grandson, he looks just like you And like you, he loves Christmas too And we still sing the songs he sang us Spring comes round again with promises of new beginnings the summer days flow running home under street light glow fall brings quiet contemplation I guess there's nothing new the kids are But I miss you most of all I remember you But I miss you most of all At Christmas time Жарту горівки кварту зелена, 
My uh, great-grandparents came to Canada over a hundred years ago and uh, they settled in the prairies in Western Canada and there's big communities of Ukrainians there and kind of cultural stuff has just kind of carried on for several generations and in my family we've been doing the same kind of thing like music and all kinds of other traditions and uh, since we've been here in Newfoundland uh, 10 years now we've been kind of carrying that on here and kind of spreading that tradition sharing it with our friends uh, you know musicians in our band who aren't Ukrainian but uh, they come every year to our house for Ukrainian Christmas dinner and uh, and we uh, we kind of do all of the interesting uh, interesting and strange things that Ukrainians do for Christmas. So our Christmas Eve is like on the 6th of January and that's the night when we have a giant meal. There's 12 different kinds of traditional food and uh, the first course that we have it's a special kind of I guess you could say it's kind of like a porridge. It's made out of wheat, honey and poppy seeds and one of our traditions is take a big spoonful of that and throw it up onto the ceiling and if it sticks to the ceiling it means you're gonna have a good year for the good you know good luck for the whole year. So I just finished painting my living room. I had uh, seven years of porridge stuck to the ceiling and so we finally just scraped it off. So we're ready for this year to start it all fresh again. <laughs>
great music from you, and uh, I just wanted to ask you about uh, your first kind of experiences with Christmas and the holiday seasons. Yeah, first of all, I grew up uh, uh, as a Muslim, uh, so I studied Islam for years, uh, but the first time um, I was at to learn a, a bit about uh, Christmas uh, was in a radio station I was working in Yogyakarta, so uh, this in Java Islands. In Yogyakarta, both uh, religions, uh, uh, myself as Muslim and Christian, they, they are together and enjoy Christmas together, and I learn a lot. Uh, that that province is very diverse, so it it was wonderful. And you've been here in Newfoundland for a few years now, and. Uh, and really involved in the, both in the music scene and doing all kinds of other interesting things. Yeah. And, uh, and how, is, how is the holiday season for you here? Like, how do you, how do you get used to being in the, in the cold weather of Newfoundland? This is the, the most uh, amazing thing. The first time I came here, I didn't know uh, what that was. It was mummers. <laughs> do, 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 do. What was that? I thought people want to uh, do something bad. <laughs> Mummers, mummers, what is mummers? So they explained to me mummers, and as well as uh, uh, they, they, they uh, told me about the Santa. Santa has secret keys. Really? Uh, he, uh, he knows what you want. And I tried to find, uh, find out, I thought that really Santa will come with a secret key, but Santa is a symbol of joy and giving. friends from Cuerpos and uh, you guys were playing uh, kind of your own versions of some really traditional music, wasn't it? Uh, you know, more of an electronic kind of housey backbeat to it. Um, so, you know, that that's great for live performance, gets people up and dancing. But it is, yeah, it does have its roots in, in Peru, yeah. So we always like look to uh, just make a homage of like Latin sounds, sort of like gives a nod to all of those old cumbia riffs that we grew up listening to in Christmas parties and stuff like that growing up. Would those traditional kind of music be the kind of thing you listen to during the holidays? Yeah, honestly, I think that um, besides, obviously, like, uh, Latin America is a really religious society and there's a lot of those, like, you know, Christmas rituals that, like, follow those um, sort of, like, patterns and whatnot. But at the same time, we really do like to dance. And once, you know, dinner is eaten, there's always somebody turning on the radio. And many of these uh, cumbia songs and like Latin sounds are really, uh, they really made it to the playlist, you know? It's, it's yeah. something that your grandma would dance to, and your aunt, and it's something that almost by os osmosis. Sometimes we joke around how like when we were kids, uh, the uh, adults were partying and then some, you know, like we would fall asleep and just like listen to all of these cumbia songs and that gets ingrained in your brain. But yeah, it's, it's really uh, common to see uh, big dance parties uh, in the holiday season, you know, uh, after dinner and, you know, just everyone wants to like dance, decompress. Christmas, Christmas party is a dance party. Oh. Yes, yeah. for it's sure. It's a huge dance party. And it's also, we should also make note that it's warm in South America during Christmas. So, you know, it's 30 degrees, sunny out all day, so the party goes all night and it's outdoors. One of the, the main pillars of our, of our musical project, we want to uh, share a culture, um, frame it in, our, in the context that we are, the geographical context that is Newfoundland, right? And at the same time, bring some people a little bit of joy and a little bit of dancing, you know? I think that it's something really lovely to do and it's a beautiful way of expressing. Um, so, yeah, that's what we try to offer.
solé un poco, pero no arranqué. Le busqué las plumas, plumas le encontré. Sucedé un poco, pero no arranqué. Le busqué las plumas, plumas le encontré. Sucedé un poco, pero no arranqué. Le busqué las plumas, plumas le encontré. Sucedé un poco, pero no arranqué. Le busqué las plumas, plumas le encontré.
get a little older When I grow a little more When I find all of the things you really needed I will love you like before With my promises unbroken and With the laughter in your soul all my actions will be words that I have heeded I will love you like before And I will learn Every little thing And I will win Every battle As your child, every dragon at my feet, and I will conquer every land. I will be a better man for you, my island queen.